Hi everyone, Sandra here from the Chauvin's Nest. I wanted to share with you a farmhouse shop that I did at Zares Market and a DIY haul from Dollar Tree. I'm going to start with the Zares Market. Hope you enjoy it. This is considered a bath towel because it's terry cloth on the other side, but I thought it would be nice as a throw. wood and part marble. I just thought it was so pretty. This tray was really pretty. $30. I just got one that was very similar for $5 at the thrift store. This is a salad bowl but I thought it would be really neat to have a, a potted plant in here or use it as uh, some kind of base maybe even for a small Christmas tree. This is supposed to say male, but to me it looks more like maid, so I'm not sure I would get this. I'm always checking out the Dollar Tree for some new DIY items. I got some old standbys, but I also picked up a few new things. These are some vinyl wall decals. They're one big page and they show them for behind a backsplash, but I thought some of the images were kind of cute with this coffee one and uh, the other one with the nice sign in the center of it. So I think they're probably going to get cut out and mounted on some wood boards. These are the burner covers that they carry. They come in a couple of different sizes and different varieties. I thought this would be neat to make an old uh, metal sign for the kitchen or any other room, so I'm going to give that a try. These are some of the wood signs that they have at the Dollar Tree. I had the home sign before, but I decided to get the Live Laugh Love, and I'll probably put that on some type of sign as well. After I was done my shop, I decided to go into Walmart to see if they had any farmhouse items. The one really close to me that I went to is 
quite small so it didn't have a lot of variety. I did check out the seasonal items because I know they're starting to bring in some spring and summer decor for outside and I picked up this metal wall art sign. It's a compass and I just thought the distressed look would be really great in my living room. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and click the bell to get notified when I upload a new video. I'm going to be using a lot of these DIY Dollar Tree items in home decor, and I'll be sharing those with you in the near future. Thanks for watching.